Well, thanks for tuning in, everyone. Well, we are back at it again. The Three Amigos. We are back here at our favorite spot. Looking for more of that pretty shiny gold tinted metal. We got G GS back out. We got Chris out. So we are going to get some more Almighty AU. So everyone's getting their sluice system set up. And this time, none of us are classifying. We're just going to run bucket after bucket after bucket. So, done a lot of this area here. I'm going to actually just come right up front where it all starts, right along here. I'm going to dig down into that. And then run it through the sluice. Looks like it's set up pretty decently. You can only uh, achieve what the water flow is giving you. All right, so let's get started with it and come along for the journey. It's kind of sandy, but as I get further down, they'll end up being more gravels. And I did find some gold here when I was panning, so. That's why I'm back at this spot. We'll give it a shot and see how much gold we find from here. Yummy! So I think I ran about 10 buckets or so. I'm gonna go ahead and do a clean out. People ask, how come you don't classify? You don't need to classify. I'll pull this out and show you why. You can run more dirt by not worrying about classifying your stuff. Just run it. These bigger rocks, they'll just sit on top of the riffles. All the gold and the sand and the garnets will sit underneath. It really doesn't get disturbed, especially when you got smooth water flowing over like this. So, yeah, you gotta, you know, move some rocks, move some out of the sluice, but it's still much faster than classifying. All right, let's get this out of the water so we can take a peek at that V-mat because it looks good. What a gorgeous day to be out again. And we're taking advantage of this right now because it is 55 degrees gonna be today. And then uh, by the end of the week, it's supposed to be almost 75, 80 degrees. So this river is just gonna come on up. So we might not have access with all the snow runoff as it melts with that 75, 80 degree weather, but we'll see how it is. If it's uh, accessible, we'll be back out here next week on that nice hot day. All right. Let's see if it'll show up. Ah, there we go. All that is gold. Looks pretty good. 
back on it again. Let's see if it looks any better in the sun. Alright, so we're gonna clean this out. And then uh, we'll run, I think, another 10 more buckets or so. Yeah. You should classify before you run your dirt. Yeah, well, there's proof it's not really needed. Just run the dirt. More gold from more dirt. Up. Jason's using his little beast mode. And oh, he's catching the gold. Yes, it is. Look at all that. Wow. Nice. Oh. And the man's not classifying either. Big rocks roll right Big on down. Big rocks roll right on down. Right on down. Who needs to classify? Raise your hands. <laughs> I'm keeping my hands down. <laughs> Let's go check out Chris. Let's see how Chris is doing. How we doing, Chris? Yeah. yeah. Some pretty good color in there. Yeah. Finding some good color in that hole. Good. Go that way. Yeah. Yep, nope, perfect. I wouldn't go any further into the bank. Just start coming this way. Pull those big boulders out of there. Yeah, as soon as the gold are underneath those boulders. Yeah. Have you ran anything through this? Yeah, I just heard it. Oh, okay. I was going to say, there ain't nothing in there. <laughs> <laughs> <That's> like, <laughs> I was coming over to check out his sluice, and I'm like, there's nothing in it. Well, hopefully, it didn't get washed out. But he's got his setup looking pretty good. 
He's doing real good. We're gonna get him some V-mat and put on this sluice here. I have some extra of that so he can see and identify if you're on good ground. All right, so I think I ran another 10 plus buckets. You can see all that. Yep, looking good. So I'll clean this out and see how many more buckets I can run before my back is already telling me to quit. Well, third time's a charm, and my back's telling me you're done. So, there's some gold pieces there. All along there. So, I didn't run as many buckets as the first two runs, but I think we did pretty good. Hopefully, I uh, see a little bit more than I saw the last couple times here because. I put in a whole bunch of buckets. All right, let's get this cleaned up, packed up, and get on out of here. Okay, well, it's been more than a week for me to get to the cons from the river, but there is all the cons. There's three cleanups. And what I'm going to do is, normally if it's a one or two cleanup, I'll go ahead and pan it, which still takes me a while because two thirds of what you're looking at is literally black sand total black sand and it just makes for a real slow painting process so i'm going to run it through a 1 8 inch classifier and then we'll classify the plus and then we'll take the minus and we'll run that through the cleanup sluice which will speed up the process so i can get all this down to basically two tablespoons to pan out which is a whole lot easier so let's do that Right back in the gold room. I know you guys haven't been in here in a while, but we're gonna go ahead and run. That's the leftover cons, the minus one eighth inch, and we're gonna run it through the stripper mat on the multi sluice. So I've already got some rinse agent in there. Let's get this on. Okay, let's turn it all the way up. And that's full blast on 1100 GPH pump, but we're gonna turn it down some. Right about almost 800-ish. And we'll run that through and see what kind of gold we got out of that. Got some gold pieces sitting right there already. Two of them right there. All right, so burn through that in about, I don't know, five, ten minutes, somewhere around there. There's some good looking stuff still showing up. Okay, well, that was a fun trip. It's always enjoyable time going out with the guys on the river there uh back to our favorite spot but it's getting pretty close to that where you have almost gone through it all so might have to look for some different areas to play with but hey good time nice weather good friends you can't complain you know let's take a look at the gold not too bad i think i did pretty good i'm happy with that it's a bunch of fine pieces but we all know fine pieces add up so, uh, next video coming out is going to be another ore crushing video, but it's getting to the point where I got two more of those sessions to go, and that last one's going to be a sweet one. Wait till you see that one. Um, in the meantime, you know, we'll make that video, and we'll get that out here soon. And, uh, you know, help a brother out, like, like this video, hit that thumbs up, and uh, share the video. That also helps me out, too. 
Um, and if you haven't subscribed, please do, because I appreciate you the most. Thanks again. Until the next time.